Hi, I'm Mike Benton for AllShadow.com, and I'm pleased to bring to you how to install Opera Mini 4 on the T-Mobile Shadow. So go ahead and go to Internet Explorer, hit the menu button, and go to the address bar. We're going to type in www.operamini.com. Opera Mini is an alternative browser which is really useful for using viewing large web pages. Now go ahead and uh, scroll all the way down to where it says try the new Opera Mini 4. Select that. So we're going to install the newest version. Go ahead and download the high memory version. Now what's great about this is not every web page translates in Pocket Internet Explorer well so it's kind of hard to view a large web page. Go ahead and hit continue here. But uh, Opera Mini, go ahead and hit yes, actually makes that possible uh, by doing server-side interpreting. Go ahead and hit OK here. And it sends JPEGs and very little amounts of data. Go ahead and hit yes here. So the rendering of a web page is actually faster for the full size. Go ahead and hit yes for this and OK for this. The thing about Opera Mini is it's Java, so on some phones it's actually a quick loading scheme, but uh, unfortunately it actually you have to push a couple yeses and okays to get this to load. Now here's some tips and tricks on uh, how to use it a little bit better, so take your time and read through that. Um, and then if you really feel like it, you could read the end user's license agreement, or you can press the left soft key to accept it. Uh, so we're just going to read it real quick here. Okay, a little speed reading, all right, and we'll click OK. And here's our front page, some quick links there. Uh, we're going to go ahead and click here to edit on the address bar, and we're going to put in allshadow.com to show you something. Allshadow.com is actually set to recognize pretty much every mobile device. Uh, and so go ahead and hit the right soft key for menu, and then OK. And then it'll load. So Opera Mini well, is actually still going to load it as uh, the mobile version that you see in Internet Explorer. However, at the top you have the RSS feed, which is cool because you can subscribe through Opera Mini to RSS feeds. So let's go check out PocketNow.com. A little typo there, hold on. Pocket Now will render full screen size through Opera Mini. Okay, hit Menu and OK. Wait a second, it will load. And it actually deals with Flash pretty well, interpreting it. You can't really view Flash, but it'll take a picture of it and show that to you. Now you notice there's a mouse on the screen that's actually controlled by the D-pad and it moves that little box around. You put the box over whatever it is you want to look at and hit the center of your scroll wheel and it'll zoom that in. You hit the back key and it'll zoom out. You go over here and look at this. So it pretty much looks like it would on the desktop. You hit the back button twice and it'll go to the page before. So that's a quick preview of what it looks like and how to actually install Opera Mini on the Shadow. And uh, if you have any questions, go ahead and post it in the comments. And thanks for checking it out.